Hi, it's Rochelle Bradley, and I'm heading up to my local cafe to get a cup of coffee, and I'm going to be telling you about my Tuesday teaser today. So, let's get started. Today's Tuesday teaser uh, is a <clears throat> is from the third book, and it is from Kelly's perspective. And I did, if you read the first two books in the series, uh, The Double D Ranch and Plum Twisted, it's kind of um, a thing. So it's a repetitive kind of thing. Um, in the first book, Kelly Jo Green takes her friend, Jesse, who is a heroine of the book to uh, the local donut shop to kind of ask her about uh, what's going on with her and Josiah the love interest and so in book two Kelly takes her friend Piper and asks her hey what's up with you and Cole so in book three uh, Piper and Jesse gang up on Kelly and take her to the donut shop in kind of a re reversal, a flip. And so it's funny and they, uh, and it's just a good time, good, good girl time. So us girlfriends get together and check up on each other. So this is what Kelly and Piper and Jesse do for each other. And, uh, it's gonna be fun so I'm gonna read it to you I hope you enjoy it thanks for joining me today on my channel hi we're gonna try this outside here but it might be too noisy so I'm just gonna preface um, my Tuesday teaser a little bit um, like I said before uh, Kelly is getting kind of ganged up on by her friends uh, Piper and um, Jesse and they're going to um, they know something's up with her but they don't know what and she hasn't spilled the beans because she's she's um, keeping her relationship with Ben quiet um, actually they don't know she's um, they, they might they suspect she has a relationship, but they're not sure who and nothing serious. So they're trying to um, get her hooked up, fix her up. And they dared her at a picnic to um, ask out Ben. So here they are kind of ganging up on her, trying to find out, trying to get the low down and uh, see what's up. So I'm gonna go ahead and start reading and I hope you enjoy it. Oh, and I, I moved outside. One of the reasons I moved outside is because um, there are um, some not family friendly words. So I'm gonna wait till the family walk by, and uh, also des desire makes an appearance, and you know you don't know what you know flies out of her mouth. So um, I am going to start reading. Here we go. Kelly refused to look across the table at her best friends, Jesse and Piper. Instead, she stared over at the cashier as the teen rang up a customer. Saturday morning buzzed at a hole-in-one donut shop. Several families munched on fresh donuts while sipping coffee, juice, or Kelly's favorite, the chocolate mocha. Um, Jesse drummed her fingers on the table. Kelly sighed and fingered a mug. So, Piper started, what's up with you and Ben? Nothing. Kelly lifted her mocha to her lips. That's bullshit, and I know bullshit since I live in a ranching town, Piper said, pointing at Kelly. That sounds familiar. Jesse tapped her chin, eyes narrowing at Kelly. Where have I heard that before? Kelly used that on me when I was at first attracted to Cole. Piper said. The night you lost one of your bras to him, Kelly chuckled. Yeah, that's in book two. Fun story. Um, 
Then Jesse frowned at Piper because Jesse created it. Um, I got it back, Jess. Piper crossed her arms over her breasts and shivered. Kelly tried the bullshit thing on me too when she suspected Josiah and I had a thing. Jesse admitted I was right. Kelly grinned, waving her hand. Jessie narrowed her eyes again. Now what's this about you and Ben? Kelly tried to guard her reaction to Ben's name because every time they mentioned him, her heart fluttered and she felt heat creep to her face. What's what? She asked, glancing at the cashier again. Piper coughed. <coughs> Bullshit. They all laughed. Jesse and Piper shared a look. Whoa. It's kind of windy. If it starts to thunder, I'm gonna run away. FYI. That's not in here. <laughs> um, Kelly relaxed. Oh wait, let's see. Jesse and Piper shared a look. Jesse played with the corner of her napkin and chewed her lip. Piper narrowed her eyes and humped. There's something going on with you two. Kelly relaxed, confident. They hadn't figured anything out. This meeting was a fishing expedition. She reached for a donut hole and popped it into her mouth. She grinned, enjoying the chocolatey flavor. Have you asked, been out yet? Jessie asked. Kelly shook, took another sip of her mocha. Mmm, that's good. Exasperated, Piper pleaded, Kelly, come on. Kelly shifted on the hard booth. I haven't asked him out. Why not, Jesse picked up her mug. I know you think he's cute. And we saw how he looked at you, Piper added. His gaze was so intense it could have ignited my underwear. I know, it's just, Kelly shrugged and sighed again. Sawyer made me cautious. I don't wanna jump into anything serious. Jesse nodded and but frowned. Sawyer wasn't right for you. And I get being careful, but one date to see if you're compatible won't kill you. Yeah, it's not a marriage proposal, Sawyer, uh, Piper said. She pulled the box close and took a chocolate donut hole. Oh my God, this is good, she moaned. That's what she said, Desire said, as she slept into the booth next to Kelly. So there you go, there's your Tuesday teaser, and I hope you can hear everything because of the traffic. Um, thank you for listening and being here and for taking the time to um, listen to the Tuesday teaser. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe and hit the bell so you get notifications of the next week's Tuesday teaser. And I hope maybe I should do Ben's perspective. Uh, what's your favorite character so far? I would appreciate hearing your feedback. I'm welcome back from the coffee shop. And uh, I'm just uh, passing through an area where the trees have the white flowers on it and the ground kind of looks like it's snow. Um, it's almost kind of looking like rain, so. If I start running, it means I'm getting wet. So thank you again for stopping by my channel. Um, I appreciate it. I'm just uh, enjoying giving these teasers and I hope that um, you are enjoying them as well. So uh, please comment uh, who your favorite character is in the Fortuna Texas series and uh, maybe I'll read a little bit of another teaser with them in it next week so uh, feel free to let me know and um, I am also working hard on my final edits for this project because it is going to be out in less than a month yay so I'm excited about that I know about that it's gonna be fun I'm gonna have a release party um, I'm also going to be featured in, on the roaming 
Raven uh, YouTube channel coming up in May and also on um, Christine Raymond's uh, uh, word hey, say words with friends but it's not that um, word play it's a podcast and I'll be featured on May 8th for that so um, I will put the links down at the bottom and also if you'd care to read the full blurb for book three I will put that in the, bo in the uh, bottom as well so please subscribe and until next time